What is up guys, welcome to Sweets and Boat. Today I'm gonna take you a tour on my engines. Uh, these are Mercruiser 4.3 LX. And uh, sometimes I have had trouble finding components, so I have to Google it and stuff. So I'm gonna point some of the things out uh, that I haven't been looking for. Um, and hopefully this will help you too. So let's take a tour down into the engine room. All right guys, so I have two of these uh, 4.3 LX engines, all rusty and uh, crusty and nice. I'm not using these uh, covers really, but it says, uh, yeah, 4.3 LX E6 Alpha 1 balance shaft Thunderbolt 4 ignition. So, first of all, what you should look at? I don't know, maybe fuel. Got a fuel line coming here, goes into a fuel filter down here. Up to a fuel pump, pretty straightforward stuff, and then up to the carburetor. All right, some ignition components. So, first, turn the key, come to the slave solenoid, gonna give power to the starter. Here, you have the circuit breaker, you can see it in the manual. And ignition coil down there, so that will be behind on the port side. So, here's the exhaust for the port side. Ignition coil down there. It's the same on my other engine too. Right there. Little line running to the distributor. Yeah, and then we have some more obvious stuff like the uh, alternator there. On this engine here, I have the power steering pump thing with the fluid in it. You can just check the fluid there. On the starter on these engines is just follow this way down here and it should be right there. Hmm. It's amazing my engine is still working, right? Right, got front of engine here and back here we have slave solenoid. Gives power to the ignition. Return the key with the circuit breaker. And one thing that I've been looking for for a while, to understand where it was, is down here somewhere. The, yeah, there it is. So uh, that wasn't that obvious to find. Took me a while. That is the oil pressure warning switch. Gives you that uh, signal before you get oil pressure when you start it up. So that was tough to find. So it's back at the engine and between the ignition coil and distributor that little fellow up on the block also part of the ignition system i guess is a little switch down here a little switcheroo see if we can find it on the other side there it is the actual switch is down here. A little button. Uh, yeah. So apparently that cuts off the ignition. Now you put it in and out of gear. Oil lines go down. They end up down here. Oil lines, you can see some oil lines. In somewhere, that is the oil pressure sending unit right there with the oil lines, oil pump stuff, and that is located you know, down on the port side. So just go down, follow the exhaust. All right, quick uh, recap front of the engine, back of the engine. You have the slave solenoid and circuit breaker up here. You have the alarm for low oil pressure. That's the sending unit that we saw there. Top of the engine. And then on this side, underneath, back here, you have oil pressure sending unit and oil pressure cutoff switch. So that's the oil system for you. Oil filter. I have my oil filter up here. Some engines have it somewhere else, but this has lines up here. So pretty convenient fix that on this one all right guys that's it a little tour of the engines on the 4.3 mercruiser lx i hope it was helpful these are some things that i've been looking for and try to find a location on it thanks for watching